Hey everyone, welcome back to Wrath of Math. In today's video, we're going to be answering the question, what are overlapping sets? This is not a term we see super often, so I thought it might be nice for the people that do search it up to find this video on it. And I'll try to keep things short and sweet for us here. Start off with this diagram. Overlapping sets are sets that intersect like this. So let's just say that the purple set is A and the blue set is B. So for two sets to be overlapping, they need to have some elements in common, which means their intersection is not empty. The only other restriction for two sets to be overlapping sets is that they cannot be subsets of each other, so neither set can exist entirely within the other set. B cannot exist entirely within A, and A cannot exist entirely within B which also means that overlapping sets cannot be equal. So let's go ahead and jot that definition down. So here is our definition. Let's read it one more time. Sets A and B are overlapping sets if A intersect B is not equal to the empty set, which remember means they have to have some elements in common. A is not a subset of B, and B is not a subset of A. And remember that them not being subsets of each other means that they cannot be equal, because equal sets are subsets of each other. So one more time, nice and simple, two sets are overlapping if they have some elements in common, but neither of them are subsets of the other. And if we wanted to, we could also generalize this relation to talk about more than two sets, and the definition generalizes pretty intuitively. Anyways, let's just leave off with a few examples. So here is an example of two overlapping sets. They are overlapping sets because they have some elements in common. They have five and six in common, so their intersection is not empty, and neither of them is a subset of the other because, for example, A has one, B does not. B has zero, A does not. So their intersection is not empty, they are not subsets of each other, they are overlapping sets. Here's an example of sets that are not overlapping. The intersection of C and D is the empty set because C is the empty set. Additionally, C is a subset of D, so these are not overlapping sets. One last example, these two sets are not overlapping sets because E is a subset of F. So one last time, two sets, A and B, are overlapping sets if their intersection is non-empty and they are not subsets of each other. I hope this video helped you understand what overlapping sets are. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, need anything clarified, or if any other video requests. Thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time, and be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math lessons on the internet. And a big thanks to Valo, who, upon my request, kindly gave me permission to use his music in my math lessons. Link to his music in the description. I got teeth behind my eyes Tear the flesh from what is sacred In my dreams I never die